everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cindy. A while back ago, I did a video introducing to you one of my favorite book series called the Night World series by LJ Smith. And today we're going to talk about when or whenever are we going to get the last book in this series, book 10, Strange Fate. When is it coming out? I really want to read it. I've been waiting for it to come out for 15 plus years. Am I gonna wait more? Or better yet, am I gonna wait another 15 plus 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 years? <laughs> so, Strange Fate is book 10 in the Night Rule series. And it has, sadly, the author has been on hiatus for writing this series since 1999. I went online and I did a little research about Strange Fate and this is what I found out about the last book in this series. So Strange Fate is about a girl who happens to have two soulmates. Let me talk to you more about the soulmate principle of the Night World series. So soulmate is that one person that you cannot live without because without them you are not complete and how do you know that you found your soulmate according to the night world series is you form this immediate connection when you kiss them touch them or when they uh, suck blood from your throat if your soulmate happens to be a vampire in this <laughs> series so I did some digging, so this is basically the synopsis for Strange Bay. It is about a girl named Sarah who has been having visions and dreams of the night world. And she happens to be telling her best friends about this named Mal and Kurlan. And they reveal to her, hey, we are part of the night world and she's completely blown by it because she may be the key to help stop the apocalypse and help restore the peace between the humans and the night world. It's like at the same time that there's a cold war between the humans and the people of the night world, there is a supposedly apocalypse that is going on. And mind you that this was written in the 90s. So back then they believed the apocalypse was supposed to be when, you know, where we reach the year 2000, then it will cause a chaos in our, our time system and time will stop because we will not know how to keep track of anything less than the year 2000. Yeah, they, they think the millennium, there might be a lot of chaos and this was mainly kind of the catastrophic plan that the Night World series revolves around how these four wild power is able to stop this apocalypse and stop the world from ending and time from stopping and, and I think the main reason why LJ Smith has been a hiatus from this book is because of apocalypse because realistic why the apocalypse really didn't happen we didn't get a time freeze time moved on after the year 2000 it didn't stop we kept going on and I think that's when there was a problem because if you introduce the idea of the night world series into modern time like the year 2019 then it seems a little bit oblique because it counter interacts and some of the ideas from the 90s will not really mix well with the current ideas of 2019, right? So I think that's why she's been hiatus is because she's trying to incorporate millennials with modern time. So a little bit about the Night World. The Night World is a secret organization of werewolves, witches, shapeshifters, and vampires, and they live among human beings. And there are two rules of the night world that you cannot break. One is to reveal yourself to a human. And two, fall in love with a human. 
And this is where Circle of Daybreak comes into play. Circle of Daybreak is a organization of humans and people of the night world who wants to keep the peace between the two worlds and they don't really care about the two principles of the night world because they just want to maintain peace among all. So think of the people of the night world as the bad people and Circle Daybreak as the good people. So they are trying to find the wild power before the other do. So the wild powers have very strong powers <laughs> and they can use their power to stop the apocalypse because the night world doesn't care about the apocalypse because the night worlds are immortal beings. They can't be killed easily. So if the human race is completely wiped out by the apocalypse, then the night world will rule the earth. What are your thoughts about the Night World series and Strange Faith? When do you think we will be able to read this book? I don't know if we are ever going to, but like my heart knows I will one day, one day. Hopefully not when I'm a 80 year old woman, but you know what? I will keep having hope that we will be able to read Street, uh, Strange Fate one of these days very soon in the future. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for upcoming videos and I will see you soon guys. Bye!